7 First Alert Meteorologist Mike Taylor, of course, tracking that storm as well as our weather here back at home. And man, we have some really nice weather here. Yeah, I'm happy to say that at least our weather is going to be peaceful yeah. and quiet. But yeah, down in the tropics, it could be a decent tropical storm system. It's going to run out of time as far as reaching that hurricane criteria. And the atmosphere is not really conducive for it to really intensify. Winds at 50 miles per hour, gust at 65 miles per hour, moving very slowly, but it's only 95 miles uh, southeast of the coast of Texas there. And look at this weird track. It can make landfall, but the reason why the cone looks like this is because some models are just keeping it right off the coast, but they're allowing it to travel along the coast, which can cause some flooding concerns for our friends down in Texas. Back at home, high pressure dominant atmosphere keeps things quiet and also keeps things bright and also dry, but it is cooling us down. Temps right now we're in the 40s. Lapeer at 40 degrees. Port Huron, you're at 37. So a chilly start. Ann Arbor as well at 39. And Detroit is at 47 right now. Here's a look at what you need to know. Fall, it arrives tomorrow. So today is the last day officially at least of summer, but ironically the first week of fall brings a warm up. We'll have some 70s and 80s this week, so today we climb up to 70 degrees, but by tomorrow mid 70s and so on, we continue to warm up and it looks like the dry stretch of weather is going to stick around too. We finally start to get some rain, but it looks like that's not going to arrive until the weekend. So a plan your day forecast scenario here. Cool and bright start with numbers into the 40s, slightly milder for today. We'll have a high of around 71. Sunny skies stay with us through the afternoon and into the evening. We'll clear the skies up a little bit. We're going to be watching for some more of that wildfire smoke. We're going to be tracking that, but I'm still expecting some bright skies for today. By tonight, clear 48 degrees winds from the southeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Next three days, remember, the first day of fall will be for Tuesday and ironically look at those temperatures near 80 degrees on Wednesday, 79 on Thursday and 78 on Friday and there's the rain for the weekend. Looks like it's going to arrive on Saturday, but better chances for rain on Sunday. We got a big